here with another relaxing shave video and I don't know how relaxing it's going to end up but it's going to start relaxing maybe <clears throat> today's shave is going to feature two items that I've had on the shelf for a minute I have not used these yet uh, I saw them around Christmas time at the Dollar Tree take it for what it's worth man whatever you want out of this is what you get uh, Polero Shave Cream and Aftershave Lotion. This one is Cedarwood and Eucalyptus. And this one is Charcoal and Bamboo. You can see that there. Um, we're going to do a shave with them. And we're going to see what it does to my skin. <laughs> I don't know what it's going to do. I've never heard of this company. I don't even know if you can use a brush with it. Uh, it says on the back, apply generous amounts to face. Spread around areas to be shaved. Using razor, gently remove applied cream. Rinse and dry face. Apply aftershave lotion. So, uh, we're going to give it a go. Now on the back, the ingredients for the soap, it says it's water, steric acid, palmitic acid, glycerin, glycerol stearate, and a bunch of other stuff that is like nine letter words. Don't judge me. Uh, fragrance, balsam, and eucalyptus. So... This is the uh, cedarwood and eucalyptus. I think I'm going to go with this one and save this one for another day. The uh, charcoal and bamboo. We'll use it another day. So uh, I'm going to wet the face. Let me grab a rag real quick. Hang on. I always manage to forget this. I'm going to wet the face and uh, we're going to apply the lather. Let me take off my glasses because... We are going to, uh, I'm thinking I'm not going to bowl lather. I'm just going to put it on the brush and put it on my face. Let me say, I'm hoping that uh, when I showed that, that it was, it was correct. Uh, what I mean by that is the writing was right. God, if that makes any sense to y'all, I don't know. I got the front camera on now so I can see myself instead of looking in the mirror. But I'm hoping that that is legible. That is not backwards. I don't know when I go to edit it. Then I'll be shit. It's wrong. But it may get played anyways. Who knows? You know how we are here. <laughs> if you watch my channel, it's a whim. So The brush we're going to be using is the Yaki. 24 mil Sangrata Familia Synthetic Tuxedo Knot. Beautiful brush. And I don't think it's going to be showing right, but hey, what do I know? Uh, let's get into this. Should have had something to cut into it. Like me to be prepared for a video, right? Damn, they didn't want you stealing it. God. Okay, here we go. And like I said, this was during Christmas time, so Jesus, there's the box. So I'm guessing it was maybe a Christmas set. Look at this. Look how much glue is on there. Look at that. Look at that glue. That's how, <laughs> that's how much glue was on there, man. Look at that. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> there's still glue on it look at that look at that glue on there come on man god man not not too well on packaging i mean look at that <laughs> that's glue <laughs> on the uh it's glue man wow oh well hey it's a 
buck. Okay, let's use the uh, shave cream. Hopefully I don't have to puncture the... Really? <laughs> well, it's fresh. Jesus. Okay. God, there's even glue on that. All right. <laughs> glue on everything, man. It's one of those shakes, huh? Okay, I just dip the brush in the water. A little shake. You don't have to soak it. You can if you want to. Ooh. Right there. Maybe just a tad more. I don't know. Maybe too much there. Smells good. You know, kind of. I don't know. I'm going to re reserve my judgment. Sprinkling just a little bit of more water on it. Here we go. This may have been a bad choice in a brush. These synthetics take a minute. There we go. To get going. I hate how the water just drips out of them. I'll be honest. I think my last video, I used the bore. And you gotta pretty much force the water out. But these, man, it just comes out. As soon as you start lathering, the water just goes everywhere. At least for me. Anyway, your mileage may vary, as they say. But this synthetic, it's got some backbone, man. It, uh, it's not like my, my Razor Rock, you know, plus salt. It's got some backbone to it. You really gotta, you gotta work this thing. So that's good. On those, uh, those days where you have a couple of days growth, several days growth, and you want a good scrub. Not so much on days that, that you shave every day, at least for me. So, all right, I'm just gonna, dare I put a little more water on here, but I need to work some water into this lather. Let's try. Hope everybody's well, good. Uh, another hot day here today. 72, I think that's 72, something like that, springs around the corner, man, <sighs> with this cold and dreary weather, I don't know if it's going to lather up anymore, y'all, I'm trying, this may be all it is, right here, I'm thinking so. It's not blooming anymore. But that's what the brush looks like right there. If it'll focus in on that. Probably not, but it almost has like a lotion smell. Some of y'all probably thinking, dude, you probably grabbed the lotion. I checked twice, made sure. I got so used to doing the videos with the rear camera, it seems weird looking at myself now. <laughs> All right. Jeez. For a buck, hey. We'll see how it goes. Uh, the razor, since I haven't used it in a minute, it's the Fatip Grande open comb. Because I got a couple of days growth, so why not? Let's open comb it. Three-piece razor, by the way, in case y'all didn't know. And feather blade. Man, what is wrong with you, right? Let's do it. Why not? I'll, I'll be the guinea pig for y'all. Feather blade. Over 
over the pins and post. Boom. Won't focus with the front camera. It's the only thing I hate. I don't know if it's because it's an older phone or what. But not very tech savvy, man. I'll be honest. And if y'all own one of these five tips, five tips, however you say it, it's an Italian design razor. They are known to have issues sometimes with alignments on the blade. So if you're having bad shades with it, just check it and make sure that it's aligned like that. If that'll focus. Probably not. I probably won't use the front camera no more. I like the rear camera because it zooms in and focuses. So here we go. Nothing yapping. Let's get to shaving. What man? Check and make sure that blade's in there, cause wow, man, that is smooth. Damn. Whew. Wow, man. All right, let's go this side. Line up the sideburns again, right, y'all? You know? They probably won't be even until they grow in some more. But we'll fake it till we make it, right? Wow, man. I may have found the perfect, perfect blade for this razor. Wow. Wow. That's all I can say. Wow, first pass done. Damn. That was good. Cream did good. I think it's probably more the razor though. Too blade. But Let's go again. I want to know for sure. The second pass would be more telling. I can tell you it's dried up. Look at that. That's dry. See that? That's dry lather. That's dry. So, I'm going to dip this time. And yeah, I probably dipped too much. Well, of course, I think this is the second, third time I've used this brush. Got it. Because I thought it, you know, I thought it was a very beautiful brush. And it's a good brush, you know. I'm not knocking it. I just haven't used it that much. That's my fault. Not the fault of the brush. I like Yaki brushes. You hate me. That's fine. I oh, know they're Chinese made. I know, dude. You don't have to preach to me. It's okay. I like them. All right. Dry the hands. We'll go again. Against the grain. This is the test.
Wow. You know, I keep saying that a lot, but damn. That's good. I don't think I've ever used a feather in this, honestly. Tell you what, this cream is offering some good protection too. Not bad. All right, here we go. Sideburn shaving, huh? Am I right? Can't see what you're doing. I hate it when you, you know, you're trying to angle them down. Kind of like the Elvis <laughs> sideburn there, but you cut one too short, so you're cut, cut, cut until they're like up to here. <sighs> Straight razor solves that, by the way. Hard to do with a DE, it is. But it can be done. You just gotta be very patient and take your time. man and you know i don't know if y'all know but this is a hollowed handle razor so it's very light except the head the head it's got a heavy head light handle not like the king c it has the heavy handle light head and they shave differently man every razor shaves differently just because you have one doesn't mean that you can't branch out and experiment because you know, you may find one that is your razor forever. Like, um, there's no need to go any further. That's the razor for me. You found it, and that's cool. And if that's what you want, man, do it. You know, if all you find is one razor, one soap, one blade, one aftershave, man, you know how many guys would probably envy you because it's like, dude, you know, people search for that. And if you find it, be happy that you got it, you know? But if you like, you collect them and try and stuff, because I do, I mean, it's went from a hobby to like an addiction. See what I did there? Lather addict? I'm just, I don't know. <laughs> but you know, I like collecting stuff and getting to know people in the hobby. And you know, I like to make, you know, the razor stands and razor shelves and I got other stuff happening. So I enjoy it, so. Enough rambling. I'm just saying that, you know, if you find the perfect combination, man, jump on it and use it. Be happy. It's like, dude, it's just you shaving in the mirror, man. All right. I think we can probably do one more. You know me. I got to get right here. It just, I don't know if y'all can hear that. Hear all that? I got to get it. You got it. My hair grows this way on my jawline. So I like to call this a little half pass. That's what we're gonna do. And I just dipped the tips, made them just a little bit more wetter. Cause I, after that first pass, it started drying out. And I just think that's the soap. Honestly, or let me get it right is the cream no. so cream lather sides y'all get it a little half pass that's still still a good little bit on that brush there dry the hands here we go clear the sideburns Man, I'm going to have to revisit this. I'm telling you right now. It 
It is never, never this smooth. I've never had it glide like this, man. I don't know. I don't know if it's the soap, cream, whatever. Y'all know what I mean. Or if it's the razor and blade combination. I'm telling you what, right now. Whew. Wow. Mm. Pleasantly surprised. <laughs> Pleasantly surprised, man. Mm. Yeah, that'll work. That'll work for now. Mm. All right. Let's rinse all that out. Rinse this off. Mmm. Wow. I know I've probably said that about 25 times now. Alright. Let's see how much is in the brush still. That we loaded. I like showing you all this. There you go. Creamy, man. Look at that. It's got like, it's got like a lotion smell. It doesn't really smell like cedar wood. It's probably the eucalyptus, I'm thinking. I think it's the eucalyptus. There you go, right there. Mm. All right. Let's do a cold rinse. Yeah. I'll be right back. Get all that, all that soap off your face, man. You don't irritate the skin if you don't. You should always rinse. Get that soap off. All right. Dry. Remember, pat. And I'm going to use the witch hazel again because it's been kind of kind of cold. I mean, you know, it was warm today, man. But you know, like I said, I've been dealing with some dry skin, so I'm gonna go with the Thea's witch hazel. This is a face toner, aloe vera. You know, I got this at the uh, at the health store around here. I probably paid way too much for it, to be honest with you, but that's okay. I think you can find it on Amazon, I think. You know, man. Sometimes it's just, you're on a whim, you see it, you get it. So, y'all know how that goes. All right. And I'm thinking I'm gonna put put on the Lubriderm uh, post shave lotion, body face post shave, and then I'm gonna put on the stuff that come. And again, probably got way too much, but my hands. Oh man, this stuff right here. You could probably just use this as a as a post shave and be content. Good on the skin, man. Feels good. I hate that dry skin feel, man. Don't like it. Alright. Here we go. Hmm. Lotion in the mouth. Yeah. Alright. 
Is this it? No, that's the shave cream. This is the aftershave lotion right there. All right, then. <laughs> Too much glue. Jesus, man. it has one of those stoppers on it too I do have <laughs> I think of a pretty bad joke for this situation right here but uh I keep that to myself my goodness Dude, how long are we gonna sit here and watch you struggle with this thing, man? Open it up. Tell you what. Dude, you got all this stuff laying around, use it. I bet you I get into it now. Slice my finger off. Jesus. Well, maybe not. Okay. There we go. Are you kidding me, man? Good God Almighty. All right. Halfway opened. There you go. All right. Let's squeeze some. Too much. Now that one smells a little better. Almost, you can kind of smell the cedar wood a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Whew. I put too much. I squirted too much in there. Mm, man, pleasant though. Tell you what, no redness, no skin irritation from it. That's good. None of the ingredients are irritating my skin. Let me get my spectacles here. Yeah. Tell you what, that was a close shave, man. I don't know. If, like I said, I don't know if it was a combination of, uh, you know, the feather and the razor, you know, the fat tip. Man, or if it was the cream, but dude. Fantastic shave, man. No, not, not irritated. Nothing. A dollar. A dollar. For the cream and the lotion. And like I said, you know, that's the packet. I mean, I use the uh, uh, cedar wood and eucalyptus, but I've never heard of this company. Bolero, you know, it sounds Italian, but I have to look it up. I don't know where it's made. Does it say on the box? Yeah. Uh, well, made in China. Hey, <laughs> it goes with the brush, right? Uh, distributed by Bolero Home Decor Incorporated, Sarasota, Florida. So. I don't know, man. It was a buck. I saw it. I said, hey, shaving stuff. I'm pleased with the shave. Is it scent heavy? No. You know, does it have stuff in it that's probably not best for your skin? Probably. Is it a good shave? Hell yeah. I'll take it. So, I appreciate you watching, guys. Thank you. Uh, if you have not, please consider subscribing to get more great content like this, right? struggling to open up the shave lotion <laughs> you want to see it you know you do so subscribe like share you know we're about reaching and teaching man so thanks for watching guys until next time this is lather addict saying not every day begins with a shave but maybe a shave can brighten your day and we'll see you again